Okay, well, got the generator running. Runs good. So I took it out, warmed it up for a little bit. Now I have drained the oil out. I'm going to change oil. As you can see, the oil is pretty dirty that come out of it. Um, so how you change oil is on any unit, and this is on this Yamaha here, you uh, get a, let's see what size socket, you get a 17 millimeter socket, and you loosen up the drain plug, which I'm putting the drain plug back in. All right, cleaned it off and drained it real good. But you loosen it up, you need to get you a pan, such as what I got down here on the floor right now, something to catch it in, drain it into the pan. Once it's good and drained out, you'll want to tighten up the plug. So I'm just using the 17 millimeter socket. And I'm going to over tighten it. So I got it tight. I already took out the fill plug, which you can see it goes right here. I already took it out. So now I'm ready to uh, put some oil in. So I'm going to use for a funnel where it's in the, such the spot it's in, I'm going to use this. I have this long reach funnel. And it's even got a screen inside of it. And I cleaned it out. I always clean out my funnels with some brake cleaner. And uh, just that way there's no dirt or particles or anything. So I cleaned it out real good. I'm wanting it to dry out. I took it outside and cleaned it with the brake cleaner. And then I'll be ready to put this in the uh, port. And I will fill with my oil. Now the oil that I'm using, so I'm using the Vance Auto brand 1030, which is actually made by Shell this particular one it's a little bit of an older oil uh, but it's been sitting on a shelf for probably five years i bought quite a bit of oil when it was on sale a few years back and i run this 1030 in pretty much all my small engines so i'm gonna fill it up and uh i'll be good to go and how i'll do that is i'll fill it up put it in the funnel there and then once it reaches its full mark over there on the filler uh i think it's hard to see and I'll know I'm filled up. This machine does have an oil light. The nice thing is about a lot of the Yamahas and the Hondas, there is a low oil light. I have no manual for this generator, so I've been looking for some stuff online.